One of fall's best meteor showers is getting ready to reach its peak. Monday night, October 20th through early Tuesday morning, October 21st, the Orionid meteor shower, one of fall's best, will reach its maximum. This meteor shower isn't quite as epic as some others during the year, but it's still worth watching. It's been known to produce rates of about 10 to 20 meteors per hour in a dark sky location. The Orionids get their name from the constellation Orion, which is the radiant of this meteor shower, meaning that's where they all seem to originate from in the sky. But here's the thing, you don't have to look at Orion. In fact, you don't. You want to just look up with a wide gaze and give your eyes some time to adjust. Speaking of which, here's a few more tips. You want to get away from city lights as best you can. The darker your sky, the more meteors you're going to be able to see. And I mentioned this before, but be patient. You got to give your eyes at least about five to 10 minutes to adjust to that dark sky. Even better would be like 15 to 20 minutes. With most meteor showers, your best viewing is usually from about midnight through dawn, but that really depends on your cloud cover. And this is a look at clouds and precipitation forecast around midnight Monday night. And as you can see above, clouds might be an issue for parts of the upper Midwest. A cold front extending all the way down into southeastern Missouri and parts of Arkansas might also bring some clouds and rain. Good luck if you plan on watching, and this meteor shower continues through early November, by the way. There's just going to be less and less as we get farther away from the peak.